Hello everybody. Today I'm excited to be finally done with my fantasy filter to Vlog X conversion look for the Panasonic G9. Um, I've been working on this for uh, a couple of months. Well, actually since I've gotten this camera, I've been working on it. Um, if you don't have the Vlog L update for the G9 or you can't afford it or you're somewhere where you can't even order it, um, this is probably going to be your best alternative to be able to grade log type footage. Um, it uses Panasonic G9's fantasy filter that's built into the camera. It's nothing you have to download. It's um, considered a creative filter. Um, all you do is select it, make sure your exposure is good, and then film. That's it. It uses Panasonic's auto white balance to color your video. You can't tell it when you're you're filming it's going to be more of like a, a blue or neutral um, type blue or green but once you get it in the, in the computer and apply my look to it it's going to automatically colorize it for you so that way you'll be able to grade it um, edit it um, I'm including two LUTs with this one as well one is going to be already fully graded uh, I spent hours tweaking the colors to get it just right for every scene situation um, of course you still may have to adjust it but most of the scenes that you record um, will look pretty good just using that one look. Um, the other one is the base look. This is the one that is completely neutral gray. You'll have to grade it from scratch. I'm gonna make a video that shows how to grade it as well. But um, if you do not have v Vlog L and you want something a little more better than um, CineD or you know natural, and you want to take full advantage of the 10 bit that is in this camera then this is the look that you need it's going to fully change your video um, make recording fun again um, i think that you'll really like it i'm pretty proud of it because this one has been harder to make than the one for my g85 um, the only downside to it's not really the look it's the camera is that the g9s auto white balance is very sensitive meaning that um, it will change color and shift color pretty easily if you change from light to dark or move um, in a different lighting condition um, that's the only downside of it um, other than that the benefit is that you can actually go down to the lowest ISO setting since you'll be using the fantasy filter which is going to give you some really clean video footage even in low light um, but without further ado, I'm going to go into how to um, grade this footage and it will be included. I'm going to make a, um, a link for it to be able to purchase it. And um, I really hope you'll be able to make some, some great video with it. Um, thanks for watching. 